hi guys welcome to my youtube channel in this video let's learn a python program that is write a python function to count the number of vowels in a string so given a string as input to your python program so your task is to count the number of vowels that are present in a string so this you have to perform using a python function that is a problem statement so let's try to solve this so let me define a function that accepts a string as input argument and returns the count of number of vowels so this is the input and this is the output so let me define a function that is def that is count underscore vowels so this is my function name so i'll be passing a string variable as input argument so let's take a data so now I have to take two variables that is a total. So in order to return the count, so I'll be using a total variable. So that is of type integer that is total and initialize it to zero. So now we'll be keep incrementing if we find a vowel in a string. So now let's take a vowels as a string. The vowels contained in English alphabets are A, E, I, O, U. So let's take ovals equals to a string variable that is a e i o u and also in the capital. So this is a string of ovals. So if the letter present in a string contains this value, so let's increment the total. So now I have to iterate all the letters present in the data. So let's use a for loop that is for letter in data so i'll be iterating all the letters present in the string that is given string and check if using the if statement over here and checking if letter in the ovals so if the letter is present in the oval that means you have found a oval so let's increment the total total plus equals to one so yeah so once the for loop completes that means you have iterated all the letters present in the string so just return the total variable that is a integer type that is a count of number of vowels in a string so this is a python function to count the number of vowels in a string so in the main program so let's ask a user to enter a string and uh, try to print the that is try to call this function and uh, print the return value so in the main program so let's take a text variable in order to store a input string so let me use input function call over here and let's say enter string yeah so once the user enters a string so it will be stored in this variable so now we need to call this function that is count oval so let's use a print function call and uh, here let's say count of ovals is let's give colon and uh, let's directly call the function that is count underscore oval and we have to pass an input argument that is a text variable yeah so this is a complete python program that uses the python function to count the number of ovals in a string so let me run this program and let me show you how it works so executing it so enter a string so let's say enter a string so this is my string as input to the python program so you can see the count of vowels is 4 so you can see e is present over here e is present over here this is the second time this is the third time that is a is present and i is present at the fourth yeah so you can see count of oval is 4 so let me close this so let me re-execute it so let me give input to this program as this line so executing it so enter a string let me paste it so you can see count of ovals is 19 so if you can see this i e a this a and this o and if you try to keep counting the ovals present in this particular string you will find the number of ovals as 19 let me close this yeah so this is a complete python program that uses the python function to count the number of ovals in a given string so i'll give this code in the description of this video 
that's it in this video hope you liked it thank you for watching bye